Vindhyachal Super Thermal Power Project is one of the largest power stations in India. With already installed capacity of 4260 megawatt. Vindhyachal Super Thermal Power Project Stage 5, Unit Number 13 of 500 megawatt is another proud expansion to the largest super thermal power project in India. Stage 5 of Unit Number 13 with its zero date on 3rd of May 2012 has a target from Government of India for commercial decoration by September 2015. Initially, NTPC Vindhyachal Stage 5 finds some locational disadvantage because of existence of Surya Nala. It was not only creating obstruction of effective area of yard identified to different agencies of Stage 5 like Main Powerhouse Civil, Switch Yard etc. But also during monsoon, it used to create a huge damage to the surrounding area of powerhouse with flooding of rainwater. To mitigate such recurring problem from the very beginning, it was a huge challenge to Vindhyachal civil team to divert the flow of Surya Nala at the earliest and civil Vindhyachal team took all possible measures with execution of Nala work round the clock and finally Surya Nala diverted in time with providing necessary area to all other agencies at stage 5 for their office and other establishments. Immediately after award of work, main focus was given on availability of approach and platform to ensure speedy and uninterrupted execution of civil work round the clock, particularly during coming monsoon season. Vindhyachal civil team made all efforts in this direction and RCC road around main powerhouse including switch yard area for a length of about 3 kilometers made at the earliest and well before monsoon to ensure uninterrupted civil work during monsoon 2013. Continuation of structural work during monsoon was also a challenge of civil group and for that, fabrication yard area was totally made hard crusted with provision of weatherproof covered shed to ensure uninterrupted work of welding, painting even during monsoon. In power project, starting a boiler erection always remain a major milestone and start of boiler erection plays a crucial role in timely implementation of the project. Civil contract awarded on December 2012 and immediately all resources were utilized for execution of piling in record time and completion of boiler foundation with hard crusting of area to BHEL well within scheduled time. Vindhyachal civil team took a further proactive measure to complete the critical bottom ash hopper foundation inside boiler cavity which otherwise remained difficult after starting of boiler erection and delayed the bottom ash hopper erection by at least two months. As we all know that boiler erection start is one of the major milestones as far as power project construction is concerned. In order to achieve the same, as soon as the LOF LNT was awarded, we got three months time to complete to complete the boiler foundations. Taking pro, uh, proactive action, we mobilized the full resources so that the boiler foundation could be completed within the scheduled time. Not only the boiler foundations were handed over in the scheduled time, hard crusting was also done in order so that the crane can move properly and a, a, a concrete pavement right from main road to the boiler, boiler was provided so that the uh, erection work can also continue during the raining season. Not only handing over a boiler with hard crusting made available to BHEL in record time, but also approach to boiler to facilitate transportation and erection of materials was also ensured with making hard crushed approach from main road to the boiler cavity. Readiness of boiler foundations along with hard crusted approach inside and outside boiler finally resulted record erection quantity of 20,400 metric ton by BHEL in Vindhyachal Unit 13 
in a year in India as well as lifting a boiler drum in 149 days in peak monsoon periods. For speedy execution of all erection activities simultaneously at all fronts, an aggressive approach was taken in all inside approach of main powerhouse area after completing necessary underground facilities like sewage line, main hole, drain, etc. As on date, major approaches at all fronts inside main powerhouse are available in between ESP to ID, boiler to ESP, CD bay, a row rail track, etc. In addition to all around peripheral road at northern and southern side of main powerhouse, including switchyard area. Such wide availability of approach to main powerhouse not only encouraged all erection agencies to mobilize with full strength, but also ensure proper adherence of safety. With such availability of approach and working front, Vindhyachal project team within 31 months from zero date completed major civil and structural work at main powerhouse, erection of structure and equipment by BHEL to the tune of 25,000 metric ton out of 37,000 metric ton, which includes near completion of erection of boiler, ESP and other critical equipments. NTPC Vindhyachal team took a very aggressive program of carrying out boiler light-up of Unit 13 well before targeted schedule set by NTPC corporate management. As you see the back side, it's the long gallery which is starting from stage 3 chimney, the chimney which is uh, of stage 3 area and it goes all around the plant. The total scope is uh, of gallery 1600 metric ton on which as far as boiler light up is concerned for stage 5, the total scope is 800 metric ton. Regarding fabrication is concerned, we have already made all the galleries and trussle. As far as the erection is concerned, we have already erected 650 metric ton and rest 150 metric ton we are going to erect under one week. In this direction, during present 31st months of Vindhyachal stage 5, critical equipment foundation like FDB, PAB, IDB, IDA completed and zero meter foundations with paving at AB and BC Bay are at completion stage. Paving under ESP completed at all passes and paving at boiler cavity has already started which will also be completed before boiler light up of unit number 13. When the actual civil team took some proactive and out of box measures like concreting of chimney shell of 269 meters through pump with higher capacity which not only saved concreting time of shell by at least one month but also ensured a smooth finish concrete surface. Further bunker shell lifting made with single lift over hopper with reducing considerable time in erection and field joints of bunker together with minimizing number of erection joint to maximum possible extent. In any power project, other than main powerhouse structures and facilities, readiness of other off-site structures play a very critical and important role so far as commercialization of units are concerned. Vindhyachal civil team thus from the beginning took a proactive measure and a result before monsoon all deep excavated structures like CW pump house, raw water pump house, ash slurry pump house completed up to one meter above ground level and as on date all such structures will be ready with all facilities well before targeted scheduled. This is SLA power structure. Uh, this is, uh, it is 10 meter deep below ground level. Uh, we have completed in three months up to zero meter uh, in monsoon period. And uh, we have completed this is, uh, up to zero meter by, before L2 schedule. Further, cross-country execution of huge member of pedestals of 835 numbers of ash water, raw water at a length of about 4 kilometers are always a big challenge to any civil team. However, completion of all such pedestals are being made on raw footing basis with removing lot of hindrances and handling huge scrap materials etc. And finally, as on date, 
It is almost in completion stage and all fronts for laying required pipelines over pedestals have provided sequentially to concerned agencies. In NTPC Vindhyachal Stage 5, WFGD units that is wet flue gas desulfurization unit concept was introduced in compliance to environment clearance guidelines in an attempt to avoid pollution hazards to the surrounding area. WFGD unit established at stage 5 to reduce the emission of sulfur dioxide in flue gas produced by coal fired in boiler. It includes lime slurry preparation system, gypsum dewatering system, lime storage handling and storage system and gypsum handling and storage system. In general, other than above proactive measures, different other facilities implemented at site to ensure speedy implementation of project activities such as well-built hygienic labor huts with all facilities to get maximum productivity from labors. Besides above, labor restroom with separate toilet for ladies and gents, first aid center, drinking water facility, frequent sprinkling of water for suppression of dust etc. made available to provide better working environment at site. A lot of journey has traveled successfully till date. But still, a lot of journeys left before Vindhyachal Project Civil Group to get the taste of final success. Immediate milestone before project group is to achieve boiler light up, followed by synchronization and finally declaration of commercial operation of unit number 13 by September 2015. With the present experienced, matured and dedicated civil team together, with round-the-clock support from corporate engineering, corporate project planning and monitoring group and finally with day-to-day -day motivation and support from our respected head of project and head of region, project team of Vindhyachal Stage 5 is leaving no stone unturned to achieve each and every milestone in excellent category and committed to make unit number 13 of Vindhyachal Stage 5 under commercial operation well before the scheduled target of NTPC Corporate Management and Government of India.